flow is where everything starts and ends. Choosing the problem of flow may seem a trivial choice. However, it is at the heart of the challenge in oil recovery. One of the difficulties is that is there are a large number of scales involved. We go from nanopores to fractures which may be separated by hundreds of meters in formations that are kilometers long. And to remove that fluid from the pores requires exceptional processes that couple thermo, hydro, chemo, mechanical effects. So the problem of flow, while it appears simple, it is at the heart of the issue and is incredibly complex. The energy challenge and the environmental consequences will reach a very critical point within the next 20, 30 years, the time when we are educating the next generation of academicians and engineers. The main reason why I came here is that I was taken with the nobility of purpose of KAUST, which is spreading and sharing education worldwide. So looking back, what the adventure has really turned out to be has not been an adventure of changing cultures or countries or cities. It has been an intellectual adventure, an adventure of being able to say, if I had to start all over again, which we are doing that, what would I be? What would be the best I could be without ties and without limitations? We are looking for individuals who are clearly fascinated with what they do. That that fascination fits their commitment and dedication, and that they are willing to work as part of a group to contribute meaningful results to this world. A student who will enter a PhD or master's program at UPARC at KAUST will be afforded a unique opportunity to do research in the most fundamental aspects of the science and engineering of flow at different scales uh, from nanometers to kilometers. We are conducting fundamental goal-oriented research to address world's ever more pressing need for more energy. Research is probably one of the most rewarding activities that a human being can perform uh, if that human being has courage to do so.